Hello everyone, it's another great day of learning. My name is Sir Mark, your arts teacher for today. Join me in exploring a world full of colors, patterns, and creativity. Let's all create art from the heart. Before we start with today's lesson, let's do a quick recap of what we have studied last time. Do you remember how many principles are there? We have six principles of design. First one, unity and variety, followed by balance. Next, emphasis and subordination. Fourth, contrast. Fifth, repetition and rhythm. And last, scale and proportion. How about the elements of arts? How many are there? Yes, you are correct. There are seven elements of arts. First, the line, shape, space, value, color, texture, and perspective. Do you remember the term vanishing point in perspective? Where can you find the vanishing point in this photo of a tunnel? Yes, you are correct. In the middle. So you see, we'll be going on a virtual tour of different artworks focusing on various art movements. Because that is our topic for today. The characteristics of arts from the various art movement. The first part of this virtual tour is all about Impressionistic art movement. Impressionism is a style or movement that depicts the visual impression of the movement especially in terms of shifting effect of light and color. Characteristics of Impressionism 1. They use short broken strokes that were intentionally made visible to the viewer. Second, place pure and mixed colors side by side. Third, the result was feeling of energy and intensity as the colors appeared to shift. And fourth, use natural lights to give their painting a feeling of freshness. Next we have post-impressionism, it is expanded and experimented the bold new ways, use geometric approach and fragmented objects, example, a Sunday on the Grand Jet by George Shurat, 1884, another art movement in our visual tour is Expressionism. Expressionism is a style which the maker seeks to express the inner world of emotion rather than external. Let's take a look at the example. This picture is called The Screen by Edward Munch on 1893, which inspired 20th century Expressionists. Another art movement is what we call Fabism. It is an art style that uses bold, vibrant colors and visual distortions. It was derived from the Fos, which means wild beast, and it referred to the group of French expressionist painters who painted in this style. These are the examples.
Cubism is another art movement uh, that is derived its name from the word cube, a three-dimensional geometric figure composed of strictly measured lines, planes, and... Next, we have Dadaism. Dadaism was characterized by dream fantasies, memory images, and visual tricks and surprises. Their works appeared playful, but it arose from the pain that the European artists felt after the sufferings brought by the World War I. The artists rebelled against established norms and authorities against the traditional styles in arts. They choose the child's term for hobby horse, Dada refer to their new nun style. Surrealism is a cultural movement that began in the early 1920s and it is best known for its visual artworks and writings. The aim was to resolve the previously contradictory conditions of dream and reality. Artists painted unnerving, illogical scenes with photographic precision, created strange creatures from everyday objects, and developed painting techniques that allowed the unconscious to express itself. Abstract realism is the last art movement that we are going to discuss here in our visual tour. So, abstract realism is difficult to explain because of the infusion of two distinct styles of art, abstract and realistic. Abstract does not attempt to depict real objects as it is concerned only with the colors, lines, shapes, and rhythms that create the artwork. In a sense, abstract art is art without a concrete, physical construct to work from. Realistic art aims to create realistic interpretations of real objects. When you combine these two concepts, you get a new style of art that attempts to depict the emotions behind a particular real-life object. For example, That's it for today. Don't forget to explore your creativity and let's create art from the heart. This is your teacher, Sir Mark, and I'll see you again soon only here at Mark Ahead TV.